Tio Juve, what's the protocol if another Sancho is moving in on your clientas? Anytime there's emotions and money and business and clientas and limited resources, este pedo se pone competitive. It's un doggy dog world, carnal. It's different if you have an understudy. You know, there's respect. And you kind of hook him up with one of your clientas. Hey, carnal, sabes que? Hey, shadow me, fool. Porque you're giving him the game. Pero it's different if somebody's like challenging the old bull, running off on the plug, short stopping, stepping on toes, carnal. Ese pedo, it's a lot about respect, bro. And that's why we have the Sancho Union. That's why different dojos have different etiquette, carnal. Some of these vatos, they're like the Cobra Kai of the Sanchos, bro. Y les vale madre. They're like, nah, fool, all the clientas are for grass, my boy. Y ese pedo is frowned upon. Y por eso tenemos un self-regulating system. It's all about protecting the OGs. There's a lot of respect. And sometimes Sanchos will step in and regulate. They're gonna let you know, carnal. Esa es que you're out of line, homito. And it's all about protecting the OGs. And some of these vatos might be like, still my big homies clientas my boy you still him hey we could have did this the right way my boy we could have did this the dojo to dojo but i'm a black belt so entonces i only deal with otro dojo owners y through sancho union leaders y si tengo mis young bucks también carnal puro respeto once you have your stripes see you already passed the torch and you already gave so much game and gave battles their, their stripes and their promotions and your name rings bells entonces you have nothing to worry about carnal self-regulating chile aquí todo el sistema self-cleansing si haces un pinche cagadero that is frowned upon the sanchos will regulate entonces pull up for some more game in life i know them will share the content <laughs>